Hey guys, welcome back to our awesome gaming channel. Today we're going to be playing BTD6. And today we're going to be doing the co-op daily challenge with my friend Blue Nace again. And here we go, let's start it up. Okay, let's see. Medium standard. All those. Alright. And create match. Here, just give my friend Blue Nace just a second. He's joining in. Alright. Hey, there he what's is. up, guys? I'm back! We're having another video today, and we are doing the Daily Co op Challenge. We'll try and do it every time there is one. Yep, we're going to post almost daily videos, but yeah, be pretty exciting. We're a pretty new channel, so yeah, get ready to roll. Hope you enjoy this. Here we go. All right, first play, probably going to be Quincy. So, right here. Uh, yeah, you place Quincy, Quincy in that little... Diagonal point of the green. Yes, right there. And I'll place my ninja right there. Alright, there we go. And let's get it started. There we go. Alright. And of course, we have big balloons. But we just want that. It's a little more funny. But, yeah. Sorry if you don't like it. Alright. And first thing we're going to try to get is... Lunace is going to try to get that ninja monkey up. And of course, oh man child, we will be trying to win this, taking no damage. Yes. It's okay if we do, but our goal is to not take any damage and then beat this challenge. Yes. And we're probably going to do some other challenges, daily challenges and stuff like this. Because these are pretty cool and fun. But, yep. Let's try to beat this one. Yep. And we... For a reminder, it's not like our first one. We can use any type because it is not magic only. Yes, this is just the daily co-op challenge. All right. And next, I'm going to save up for an alchemist to buff up those Ninja Monkey and Quincy so they can pop some leads. But sadly, the Ninja Monkey has a lot of restrictions. Yeah, so... So we only got him early game just to get those early camos. But we'll have to get other towers. Yes, we're going to have to get other ones since... On this, especially the Glue Gunner, has no restrictions. But as Blue Nace pointed out, the Alchemist is pretty good. He's got all the way up to the fourth tier on the top path. And then whole one on the middle path so yeah that's pretty and, good uh main child we should not get a dark gunner like i wanted to because the only upgrade you can't get is focus fire which is sad yes that the dark lane gunner is not going to be very good in this map and the mortar monkey is pretty good on the bottom path but not well, so much the sub we'll have to find some things that we can get that and literally, the banana farm, the only upgrade you can get is long life bananas. Oh, yeah. Oh, banana the farm. full top path for Druid is open. We might get some of those. Yeah. And Spike Factory. Oh, Super path. Monkey's Tech Terror is open. That's what we'll have to get for our main popping power. And for the Heli Pilots. Oh, that looks good. Okay, the full bottom path for the heli pilot is good. So we're going to have to get Comanche Defense, Comanche De Commander, and all that stuff. And of course, really um, if you give me my money, man, if you give me your money, or I give you yours, one of us could get a heli pilot. Do you want it, or do you want me to? All right, just let me get this acidic mixture dip, and then we can save up for that heli pilot. Yep. All right, I'm going to give Blue Nace all my money so he can get that heli pilot going. And there we go. I got a heli pilot. Okay, and Blue Nace is going to go for...
or the top path first with pursuit and then he'll start to work on the bottom path all right and let me give him all my money there we go there we go i got pursuit guys rolling pretty well and as you can see that ninja monkey took care of that camel balloon very well yes and now we're just gonna save up some money and we got the mob shove to help us with the round 40 mob all right that was a lot of money so we cut that bed out and now we're back with the yeah round 35 now just waiting for that mob to show up on round 40 and we will be saving up for adora yes because she's a good hero and i'm gonna help boon ace there we go There's Adora right there. All right. In the range of the Alchemist, of course. Now I'm gonna like, get start working on that Alchemist the top path. And I'll give my friend Man Child some money. And it looks like we're about halfway there. Just a little, little under, a little over a thousand more. And guys, this challenge will be hard. Of because of the amount of restrictions they have on these towers. Yes. But we'll, we will be trying our best to win this. Yes. First try. All right. Almost there. Okay, I'll give my friends some money. There we go. Got it. Okay, let's go. We're go. We're getting some more defense, and we are starting a colony of towers. All right, next one we're gonna get will be, let's see, what, Ice Monkey. Oh, well, here's the Moab on round 40. And as you can see, that Heli Pilot destroying it with its Moab shove. Yeah, not landing there we go. Anywhere. That is why we went for the Moab shove to help us out a lot on that Moab. Without yes. it, I don't think we could have won, right? Yeah, Mayfrow? probably not. The rest of our towers aren't too good. So we should probably sell that ninja monkey and wait let's get a what should we get guys because there's no wizard and um, i'm thinking we should get we should start getting uh, an a airplane because the whole bottom and top path is open oh yes i will go for the bottom path first. And I am going to go for the mortar monkey since its signal flare upgrade is not restricted. So I'm gonna put him up here in the corner and get that signal flare going. So that should reveal all the camos. So all the monkeys will be able to shoot the tower or shoot the camo balloons. I almost have never missing target on my airplane, which will do a lot of popping power. And as you can see right here, the there we go. Seeing targets gives you so much extra popping power. And now we're just gonna cruise through these rounds. And next we should start getting a super monkey for tech terror. Yes. But it won't be very effective till tech terror because you are not allowed to get laser or plasma blast. All right, here we go. Got that super monkey. Trying to fit him in there. There we go, right next to the alchemist. And there's super range. And of course, I'll give him and some epic monkey. range. Now I gotta say up for a robo monkey. Oh, here we go, guys. Now we got this robo monkey back on round 50. And. It's still not going to be that effective because it's only shooting darts, as you can see. Mm. Which is kind of interesting to see. But of course, we'll be saving up for that Tech Terror, so it will be effective. Because Tech Terror and anti Bloom, even if you don't have Plasma Blast and Laser Blast, they still shoot a Plasma Accelerator. I mean, Plasma uh, Projectiles. Oh. Sorry for that. Alright, there we go. Now it's going to... Save up. 
And that signal flare helping out a lot with those camos. Because Quincy is the only one that can detect camo other than the mortar monkey. A little under halfway there to get in the tech terror. Alright, and we are almost... Actually, since we probably won't have time to get the Tech Terror, so I'm going to give all my money to Blue Nace for him to get Comanche Defender on his heli pilot. There we go, Comanche Defender. All right. And I will also try to get a Robo Monkey before round 60. And it'll be right there next, also right next to Alphamus. All right, there you go, Blue Nace. Super range and epic range. Okay, we almost have it. All right. Almost there. Oh, and here comes the BFB. Of course, I will use my power on Adora. Oh, there, there we go. go. Victory. No problem. Thanks for watching, guys. Like and subscribe and go to our channel to, and turn on notifications. See you in the next one. See ya.